I have just finished recording the soundtrack for a new video. Woo! The Big Multicultural Lie. Ooh. It will be uploaded on Saturday evening. Party night! They won't like it. Who's they? I hope you do. But either way, I'm saying what I mean and meaning what I say. Isn't that so clever? Ooh. Just want to focus quickly on the picture. Martin J. Willett has used here, of Hitler. Make the lie big, make it simple, keep saying it, and eventually they will believe it. Yeah, because Hitler was multiculturalism through and through, wasn't he? Here's a quote for you that you might want to keep in mind. Why, of course, the people don't want war. Why should some poor slob on a farm want to risk his life in a war when the best he can come out with is to get back to his farm in one piece? Naturally, the common people don't want war, neither in Russia, nor in England, nor for that matter, in Germany. That is understood. But after all, it is the leaders of the country who determine the policy, and it is always a simple matter to drag the people along, whether it is a democracy, a fascist dictatorship, a parliament, or a communist dictatorship. Voice or no voice, the people can always be brought to the bidding of the voice of the leaders. That is easy. All you have to do is tell them they are being attacked and denounce the peacemakers for a lack of patriotism and exposing the country to danger. It works the same in any country. Hermann Goering, Nuremberg, Richard the Dick Coughlin, triple zero. Good night. May God be less. I look forward to it.